Sponsored by RxCardClub.com. Get a free prescription drug card and save up to 85% on prescription drugs. RxCardClub.com, Oklahoma vs. Tulane prediction, soon as hope to avoid scare from Green Wave after rough outing, Oklahoma and Tulane both experienced plenty of change this offseason. The Sooners, of course, made the jump to the SEC alongside rival Texas, bolstering college football's deepest league. Tulane saw the departure of Willie Fritz, the best coach in modern Green Wave history, for Houston. They made a very solid hire, bringing in Troy head coach John Sumrall to keep momentum going for the AAC program. Tulane saw its former head coach nearly pull a significant upset against Oklahoma just last week, as Houston fell 16-12. The Cougars' defense held the Sooners to just 249 yards of offense, rendering them horribly inefficient in both the pass and run game. The Green Wave, meanwhile, nearly pulled off an upset of their own, falling late to Kansas State at home, 34-27. Saturday's game will be the third matchup between the Sooners and Green Wave. Oklahoma has won both previous matchups, with the most recent being a tight 40-35 game in 2021. Oklahoma vs. Tulane Location, Gaylord Family, Oklahoma Memorial Stadium in Norman, Oklahoma. Kickoff, Saturday, September 14 at 3.30 p.m. ET. TV, ESPN. Spread, Oklahoma minus 13. Over slash under, 46.5. Announcers, Dave Pash, Dusty Dvorachek and Taylor McGregor. Why Oklahoma will win. Tulane's defense presents an opportunity for the Sooners to get their run game and offensive line on track. The Green Wave have struggled to contain opposing running backs, allowing 4.88 yards per carry so far this season. The defense has also recorded just two sacks through two games, a welcome number for OU quarterback Jackson Arnold, who has been taken down six times already this season. The Sooners may have something in freshman running back Taylor Tatum who leads the team with 75 yards on just six carries. That would open things up for the passing game that struggled mightily against Houston. Arnold should also get one of his main weapons back, as Nick Anderson, 798 yards, 10 touchdowns in 2023, hopes to play for the first time this season. That should help against a strong Green Wave secondary. Tulane running back McKee Hughes is a dynamic player for the Green Wave offense, but the Danny Stutzman-led Oklahoma defense is one of college football's best against the run. Tulane QB Darian Mensah has blown past all expectations, but he is prone to some youthful mistakes when pressured. Related, college football picks, expert predictions for every game in week 3. Why Tulane will win. Mensah was treated as the likely third stringer at quarterback during the offseason, but has been a revelation for some Riles team so far this year with 547 yards and four touchdowns through two games. Combined with running back McKee Hughes, 187 yards, two touchdowns, and a slew of receivers led by former Oklahoma transfer M. Ario Williams, 10 receptions, 252 yards, and the Sooners will face one of the more dynamic group of five offenses.